This is Audacity. It is a um, open source audio application and it's very good for being a free app that you can download. Um, for your assignment today, you're going to record a sentence and then apply effects to it. Um, this is the sentence that I recorded. It only needs to be 8 to 10 um, words, not a very long sentence, but you need to say it slow enough that you can um, use the effects. It will make it easier if you leave a second or two between. So th this is the sentence that I recorded. The. Whoops. I had something highlighted. Let's try that again. This is the sentence I recorded. The. Quick. Brown. Fox. Jumps. Over. The lazy dog. <clears throat> so I coughed at the end on purpose because I the very first thing we're going to do is um, learn to delete. So I'm going to bring it to the very end. The very last little bit is the cough. And what you're going to do is make sure that you go up to the toolbar and you use the selection tool. You're going to hold down and drag, hold the left um, left mouse button there, and then I'm going to hit delete on the keyboard. Now, um, a lot of people get frustrated with this because, of course, it looks very easy, but um, if you happen to have the recording paused instead of stopped, it will not let you do that. So this time I'm going to start the recording here. There, I coughed, and I paused it. Now I'm going to highlight it, and when I hit the delete key, it's not going to do it. I can go up and hit the cut. Nothing's going to happen because this is still, um, it's not on stop. But if I hit the stop, then I can do the delete. So now we have that out, and the very first effect that we're going to look at is the um, echo effect. So the effect menu is right up here and there's lots of different effects. Um, fade in and fade out, those are two really good ones. Um, normalize, um, noise removal, those um, help normalize the volume and, and um, remove background noise. It works pretty well. Um, the wah wah, um, there's just a lot of them, but we're going to use the echo. So I'm going to select and then I'm going to select beyond. So there's a spot to put it, to put the echo. I'm going to go up and click effect. Go down to, where is it? Echo. And then this little um, message box comes up. And delay time, I can have it anything that I want, but I'm going to leave it as a second um, so that it comes in the very next second. And then the decay factor means how it's fading, how much it decays. So it's going to make it half as loud as the original because it's 0.5. If I left it at 1, it would be exactly the same. And you can always preview. Da, da. So that's the preview. And I liked it, so I'm going to hit OK. And there you can see it, it put it in. I had to just select some beyond it so it had a spot to put it in. That's important. The other thing is if I want to undo it, I can undo it now. But I can't undo it after I do another step. Audacity only lets you undo one thing um, or you have to keep going back and back and back. So it's nothing where you can get a history. So um, you want to be careful because it's if you you don't want to undo everything to get back to one mistake so this is how it sounds the, the. so we'll do it one more time quick with the word quick and I don't know what that little thing is ahead of it so I'm gonna select this in about a second after it you know what I'll select two seconds after it and let's see what happens I'll have the decay factor be 
one, so it stays at exactly the same. Quick, quick, quick. See, I had it, I selected so much that it could echo three times. Um, I could also do it delay second faster. Quick, 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 quick. So um, I don't really like that. So I'll put it back in. Quick, quick, quick. And there you can see it added it. And if I didn't like that, I could just highlight it and um, delete it. And that's the very first effect.